Well, I wasn't planning on making a second video today, but this news just rocked the AI world. Sam Altman has essentially been fired from OpenAI. OpenAI just posted this announcement on their blog that it is announcing a leadership transition. OpenAI today announced that Sam Altman will depart as CEO and leave the board of directors. Mira Mirardi, the company's chief technology officer, will serve as interim CEO effective immediately. The post goes on to say Mr. Altman's departure follows a deliberative review process by the board, which concluded that he was not consistently candid in his communications with the board, hindering its ability to exercise its responsibilities. The board no longer has confidence in his ability to continue leading OpenAI. In a statement, the board of directors said OpenAI was deliberately structured to advance our mission to ensure that artificial general intelligence benefits all humanity. The board remains fully committed to serving this mission. We are grateful for Sam's many contributions to the founding and growth of OpenAI. At the same time, we believe new leadership is necessary as we move forward. As the leader of the company's research product and safety functions, Mira is exceptionally qualified to step into the role of interim CEO. It also says that as part of this transition, Greg Brockman will be stepping down as chairman of the board and will remain in his role at the company reporting to the CEO. This news is wild to me. And if I look at my X feed right now, that's all I see. Here's Igor from the AI Advantage talking about it. Matt Vid Pro, Linus Ekenstam, Ben Tossel, Suhail, Amar, Peter Yang, Alex Volkov, Taylor Peterson, Matthew Berman, Nick St. Pierre. Literally my entire feed is nothing but news about Sam Altman going. Like this is massive. I literally made a post about this 18 minutes before hitting record on this video. My entire X feed is blowing up. Sam Altman was just fired from OpenAI. I didn't see this coming. I actually thought he was an excellent and balanced ambassador for the tech. And as you can see, 18 minutes later, it's already got 8,000 views and 49 comments on it. You know, Ian Curtis here has a great point. Hopefully the board isn't choosing profits over safety. Paul here is speculating that maybe it was because they couldn't keep up with the demand. Freshly Brewed AI here says, I am seriously concerned on the way forward. Hope OpenAI board has figured it out. Interesting to see where he joins now. Microsoft, Google, Anthropic. Luca here is saying the reasons are quite hard. Something very bad must have been hidden to the company. Havoc84 here says one of the most level-headed faces and voices of a company in the wake of the most explosive industry in over 20 years. It's probably one of the most stressful jobs with half the world accusing his company of bringing on an economic apocalypse and others seeing it as the future. I'm sure a lot more news is going to be coming out about this in the coming days and weeks around why Sam Altman was fired. I also think Sam Altman's likely gonna land somewhere else. Maybe Microsoft, OpenAI and Microsoft have a deep partnership, maybe Anthropic. There's also Inflection AI. What I think would be absolutely hilarious is if somehow Sam Altman ends up at XAI. I'd say that with Elon and Sam sort of having some public Twitter slash X feuds be public, that's unlikely. But my opinion on this, as of right now, as of only knowing this news for the last 20 minutes, is that it is just mind blowing to me. In my opinion, Sam Altman always came across as very level headed, very empathetic to the people who actually feared the AI tech. When I saw him at some of these congressional hearings, he always talked about the potential dangers as well as the potential benefits. He always came across as deeply concerned about what will happen if this AI tech goes wrong. And it makes me wonder, is that the problem? Is that what OpenAI saw with Sam Altman? Is that he talked about both the positives and the negatives, and maybe they want somebody that's only ever gonna talk about the positives. Sam seems to be a proponent of open source. He's spoken at congressional hearings saying that he doesn't want regulation to hinder the open source development of AI technology as well. That likely goes against OpenAI's current board's philosophy as well. Pretty much every time I've heard Sam Altman speak, I've been fairly impressed by how level-headed he is, by how empathetic he is, by how understanding he is of the potential consequences of this technology, as well as the potential benefits. And to have one of the most level-headed voices in this space who ran the most successful, most popular current large language model company out there actually get booted out of the company that he helped start at the moment doesn't make a lot of sense to me. But luckily for Sam, since he does seem to have this aura of confidence and empathy and understanding of where all of this tech is going, he will land somewhere else if he wants to. Maybe he's just gonna retire. He's probably got the money. But if he wants to, he will likely land somewhere else. 
I can see him working directly with Satya Nadella over at Microsoft. I can see him going and taking a role over at Google or DeepMind or Anthropic or Inflection or XAI. There are so many different places that Sam would be able to step in and just with him being there, lift the company. So again, this video is sort of off the cuff. I didn't plan on making this, but because this news is so fresh and our whole AI sort of niche is going to be so impacted by the implications of this, I felt I had to create something and put it out into the world and just talk about this for a second because my mind is still in shock. Those that I know that have actually interacted with Sam have had nothing but good things to say about him, including people like Gary Marcus, who is a you know, mostly AI doomer type person. He even said that when he stood next to him at one of these congressional hearings, that he felt that Sam deeply cared about what he was doing. So with all that being said, I hope he lands somewhere. I hope he lifts whatever company he brings in. And I hope this doesn't lead open AI down a horrible path. That's really my thoughts on that as of right now with the information that I know. And again, more details will be coming out over the coming days and weeks. And expect some updates from me on where this is all going. It's just very bizarre. I never saw this coming and I'm actually surprised by how much this news is affecting my <laughs> my head around this industry because somebody that seems like a mainstay sort of consistent voice in this space just got booted out of their company. Like this is just crazy to me. Anyway, I, I could ramble on about this for a while. I'm about to jump on a Twitter space. We're gonna talk about this more on the Twitter space, but more news coming out about this in the coming days. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel. Just had to make a little ramble rant video about this news because I, I don't even know what else to say. All right, thanks so much for tuning into this channel. Appreciate you. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.